Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything, and do it soon, I'll die. Well now, look at you. Have a seat. All right. Roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy. But I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. Take a look around if you want. Hmm. I think I recognize these. Where are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but... That's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling that one crew? Piece of hard tech to find, because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait pour It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual. Relax, self. And if he starts talking about the biochip? Can't see your face. <sighs> Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this At time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. And. Might not and be important. If he starts talking Maybe. about the biochip? Myself? Bio All of them are from uh, Pacifica. Should I... Close down our search. Yeah. What now? Looks like and I'm going to I field trip. Talking to about the biochip himself? Uh, that I... is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the edges. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. What am I looking for? Every single piece of we, tech I see. We will what about his messages? Only, it's most important that he's looking for. And if he starts talking about the biochip, that is himself, you spin the virtue. Should I? The rest is none of your concern. What am I looking for? Every single piece of tech I see. Security. We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be. Parfait It's most important that it's most important that he suspect nothing. And if he what? starts talking about the biochip in the virtual. Alright, think we got Should it. Should I What do you think? 
Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me? If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into? Ugh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. What language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole? It is the Voodoo Boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Got it. Give it a second. We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Oui. <laughs> intelligent Vous gagnez un plus bon leader? Très bien. Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique ça me pense, à continuer à faire travail. Okay, Judy, we're good. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, you got any idea? The biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff. In my head. Uh, um, of course. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that net runner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that juju wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? 
I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. To make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. You really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the BDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back. V, a vehicle of mine went dark near your position. Fine. Keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. Good to see you, V. Something's pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? You look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at anchor in the bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. Just hope he doesn't blindly follow Arasaka protocol. What protocol? Unwritten rules. <laughs> Had him here in Night City. Could be different in Japan. If IA got even a whiff of treason, they'd prep an enhanced interrogator and send two elite squads with air support to grab the suspect. 
I understand the point you seek to make. But if Oda has ulterior motives, he will need no elites, no air support, no one but himself. Trust me, I have seen him work. <laughs> That's supposed to be reassuring. If it helps you stay calm, you can gaze at the sky. By God, huh? A good sign. He is usually camouflaged. I can't speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Not gonna like what I'm about to say. I need a guarantee I'm safe here. You are, you have it. V, you can trust Oda. All right then. Compeki Plaza. I was there the night it happened. Looked like your typical family quarrel until... Yorinobu lunged at Saburo and started Silence! Choking. Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly. I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. Unlike but you can't you. ignore the truth. Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath to do my duty. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. Price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your inabu sama. Sorry, but this is gonna take much longer. What would you do now? Were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to your inabu sama. Consider yourself lucky that I am not you. You cannot ignore this. Oda. You are an Arasaka soldier. This is not a request. We remind you of your duty to be truthful to your superiors. I did not come here to be lectured to by a thief. Wasn't always what I am now. And your friend here didn't always look like a bum. Feel free to join us. Plenty of room at the bottom of the heap. Not enticed? Then do your duty. Tell Hanako what nobody else wants to hear. That should be to him, as you say, food of all thought. Just gotta tell it like it is sometimes. It is a shame. Nothing will come of it. How come? It should have been obvious. Oda is a perfectionist. He most fears to make a mistake. Good fucking riddance. One hour soccer whack job is already plenty. Fine friend there. Got any more? Alas, only him. Well, can't say we didn't try. We tried, yes. And obtained something useful. Hmm. How do you figure that? What Oda said. They returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see that parade? It is our chance, perhaps, if, somehow, we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japantown. 
Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Uh, hang on. Not so fast. It could sound as easy as hacking a schism. You said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. No, just the fixer dame. Wakaku Akada. Runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Will you join me? Sure, why not? JJ Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a Night City name. Beware, you mock me too often. You alright, Goro? Yes. Why the sudden concern? Have shared interests, you and I. Or have you forgotten? Certainly not. Good. Because catching lead in Night City is easier than catching a cold. And I need you alive. I am alive and well. As you can see, you should worry about yourself. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorinobu and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile, Bigger the lies. I'm Jillian Jordan. Welcome to the World Report on N54 News. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. V, so nice to see you. And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together. That's all. Takemura Goro des. Okada san, oai dekite kohei des. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Caution. Caution? World's most wanted Japanese fugitives hiding out in Night City, and you got nothing to do with it? Please. We know they're thinking. They'll link you to us faster than you can finish puffing on that sick. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka. Again. What I fail to understand is, why come to me? 
Did Mr. Deshaun not come to the phone? Goro, remind me why Dex is fat, backstabbing ass is currently indisposed. He is deceased. Butchered and dumped at a landfill by some Arasaka goon. Real shame that. That a threat I detect? No threat, no. Asked why I couldn't reach Dex, I answered. Just facts, nothing more. Good, cause you would then have to join him. Okada-san, our intentions are honorable. We need just information. It is a matter of life and death. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? Japantown. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, the guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Not at all curious what we're going to all this trouble for. Blissful ignorance has served me well. In any case, I'll find out soon, won't I? Thanks, Wakako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. A delightful, mature woman. This information. It could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Just low profile, okay? Don't start handing out autographs. In fame, I could not overtake you if I tried. Be safe, B.
open, dragging bodies inside. As things. Anything? Mm -hmm. I need a spot in the menu here. The chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. That's right. And the drink's name. Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. Thanks, Claire. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. You definitely go for a drink. Tough day? I don't like any other. So, what'll it be? It's okay. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro. Just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her. She's got MRIs. See right through you. Give her the truth. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells. t -Bow. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Saga Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. They knew the risks. All sorts of shit happens. To all sorts of people. Even to the best. To you too, Rogue. Our Saga Tower, remember? Who'd you lose back then? Johnny something... Ah. You came prepped. Of course. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day? No. More like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm-hmm. Then see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. Not dead. 